Mama Cuzzo in the house. She in the house. She in the house. Mama Cuzzo in the house. She in the house. She in the house. Mama Cuzzo is in the building. What up, fam? You already know what we do. We come to this channel. Do you mind, please? Thank you, fam. Bye, yeah, is in. All right. Our Father was joining heaven. We thank you on today, oh, Father. For Lord, we thank you for your grace. We thank you for your mercy, oh, Father God. For Lord, we thank you for protecting us, oh, Father God, and keeping us safe, Lord Jesus. I ask you to continue to watch over my family, oh, Lord Jesus, and I ask you that this food be a nourishment to my body. This I ask in your name. Amen, amen, amen. And what up, fam? Fam, get what I got today. Fam, I like my face getting a little thick, though. You see it? Well, anyway, anyway, I be looking at myself. Okay, well, anyway, I got me some colossal shrimp. And I got me some de-shelled blue crabs. Y'all went on and took the shells off of them so that I could eat them, okay? All right, and back here I got me a king crab that I had took apart. De-shelled king crab, too, as well. But um, then I got some blessed sauce, too. Let me have some. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. It's something good. Yeah, I've been there. Trying not to get it on my shirt, fam. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hold on. These colossal shrimp taste good. Look at that. Look at that. I had to give me a picture, fam. But look at this. I like it when they this. Oh, uh. that's good. I'm popular, man. Who is good? <coughs> See these big old shrimp fam? Oh, shrimp, they really good. Real good. Mm. King crab. I must say, fam, this is really good to me. You want some? It ain't gonna taste right if you ain't got your blessing sauce. I'm gonna let you know. You got your blessing sauce? I got my blessing sauce. You got your? I got mine. You got your? I got mine. Mm hmm. This is so good. Deep shell is better. Oh, this is good, fam. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't think I could eat all this today.
these colossal shrimp got a good taste to them. That was my first time ever buying these. Because I normally buy head on if you notice. But they got a good taste. I did offer you some. You want some? Do <laughs> you want some? I offered you some. Don't be stunned talking about I didn't offer you none. Yes, I did. I did offer you some, fam. You know what I want to taste? I want to taste this, fam. With this sauce right here. Fam, guess what? Hold on. Fam, I had to go get me something to drink. I did not know this was a pepper. I thought I bought bell peppers. Oh my God. Had I been to it like that? Oh my God. Oh, I thought that was a bell pepper. I like little lady drinks. I call these little lady drinks. When I go places, fam, feel my mouth burning. Hold on. Oh my God, I thought that was a bell pepper. Ooh. And that's the most hottest. The most hottest jalapeno pepper. Oh. Hold on, fam. That messed up my, my butt taste buds. Hey, this joker, no, it was hot. I didn't even pay no attention to the pack. I thought it was just bell peppers. <laughs> oh my God. Mm, mm, mm. My mouth on fire. Oh, it's coming down here. People don't like to eat blue crab. Blue crab ain't really got meat in it. What for him? I've been eating like the. It's been so good to me. My mouth just on five from there. Mm -mm -mm. I thought it was a bell pepper. Did you not? I really did. Oh. Oh. First of all, we're going to start out by saying thank you, Lord, for waking us up this morning. Thank you, Lord, for waking me up this morning. It's five little simple words. Go on and say it now. Go on and say it. Thank you. Because he did wake us up this morning. And starting us on our way. Today we will have a good day. What? Today you will laugh and smile. Because I laughed so hard at work yesterday, y'all. I had caught the giggles so bad. <laughs> they were like, what's so fun? Somebody had did something that was funny to me, but I couldn't stop laughing about it, okay? So... Mm -hmm. I went and got some little ones. Yeah, we're gonna have us a good day. Here. Tell my chicken gonna have no good day unless you get a crab. Here, get you one. Hey, get you. Get you one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
なくああ Oh that's good to me These shrimp have a different taste from my head on shrimp. These shrimp taste better than my head on. They really do. I'm not gonna even lie to you. They taste really much better. Mm. Bitch, I won't bite that no more. <laughs> that look like to took me somewhere. This little bitty thing right here. Like to took me somewhere. I call these my little lady drinks. Like when I go places and stuff, like say for instance, if I'm going on a picnic like me and Kira did for Easter, me and Kira went on a picnic for Easter. Yeah, I set us up. I had us some snow crabs. I had us a lot of seafood. And we just sat there and ate and stuff. Then like I like to buy beers sometimes to eat with my seafood. If I buy beers, I buy little ones like this too. Cause you don't want to waste them. If I buy big ones, I'm gonna waste them. Cause I'm really not a big drinker like that. Not a big drinker, but I drink sometimes. So I always get these little bitty cans. I call them lady cans. These are for ladies. Yes, I did. I said they're for ladies. I'll put it this way. They said for a queen to be. See, I finished it. I ain't gotta worry about it getting warm. Cause I finished that right quick. What fam? I've been doing well. What about you? Why, thank you. Everything going good with me too. Thank you for asking. But look, this is what I wanted to come and tell you. This is what I want to come and tell you. Did you get God praises today? Did you tell him thank you for waking you up? You did? Okay, that's all you got to do. And you say, I will have a good day. We're going to start speaking stuff into existence in our lives, fam. I'm telling you, I was going to do a cookie show. But I said, no, I just want to eat some more seafood. You know what I'm saying? So, I, fam, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. This food is not going to go to waste, okay? These are so good to me, though, fam. I'm going to show you what's good to me. These, they so good. They got this, uh-oh, uh-oh. I'm sorry, fam. They got this different texture taste to me. Mm-hmm. It tastes real good. Well, anyway. Y'all, I can't wait to get over there and see my grandbaby and hug her. I can't wait to do that. I can't wait to see her. The only reason why I'm trying to wait, you know what I'm saying? She a newborn, you know? Trying to get them some time, and, and I'm trying to make sure I ain't got no COVID or nothing, you know, to go around that baby, which I know I ain't got COVID, but I'm going to take a COVID test and stuff before I go over there. Um, this is what I want to come talk to y'all about. About how God told me to say he's a cheerful giver. He like cheerful givers. When you want to help someone, help someone from the bottom of your heart. Don't help someone because you want to say, oh, I helped her yesterday, and now she don't want to help me. Oh, I did this for her, now she don't want to help me. You're not doing that because you're not helping someone because you want them to help you back. Damn, you're doing it because you said that you trust God and you love God. And so God said he was gonna be a, wants you to be a cheerful giver to help people. Sometimes we have a tendency to want to help people, fam. We go and talk about them behind their backs. That's why most people don't want help. Because the first thing they feel like people are going to do is talk about them behind their backs. And then, like, they look for they look for people to help them with other things, too, as well. If I, do, if I did something for you, fam, I did that out the kindness of my heart.
I didn't do that expecting something back in return. I be waiting on God to do something for me. That's what I be waiting on in return. My blessings. I be waiting on my blessings because you got to bless other people. You can't be selfish with what you got. Let me tell you. Good. Damn, it's good. I'm not lying. Especially with that blessed sauce. If you think I'm lying, it's good. And this made it spicy. So I'm, my mouth is still kind of like, I did not know this was a pepper. I thought I should have looked at it. I thought a bell pepper and I just grabbed them. Yeah, that's spicy. So anyway, let me tell you. And when God said he loved a cheerful giver when I was reading about it, I decided I'm going to come on and wind down Wednesday when I got something to give away. So I don't know which person going to get it. I don't know how I'm going to do it to give it away. But today is going to be wind down Wednesday. We're going to give away some sauces and stuff. Yeah, um, I got two sauces I'm going to give away. I don't want to do half price. If you're gonna, like I said, God like a person with cheerful giver. If you're gonna give it away, why tease them with a half price? Go ahead on and give it to them. It's okay. These people have supported me for so long. Y'all been supporting me, not just through my sauce. Y'all been supporting me through my YouTubes, through my Instagrams, and I think it's time to give back. But I don't know how I'm gonna do it because some people really get mad and they be like, dang, well, well, well. Well, this is a giveaway. Yeah, I'm giving away two sauces. I'm gonna do two. But I don't know how you're gonna win it. Yeah, so tonight, if you will meet me here tonight on Wine Down Wednesday, you get your wine together, you get whatever you're gonna drink, come on over here. We're gonna have some grown folks talks. We're gonna have some grown folks laughs. And we're just gonna enjoy ourselves. Yeah, you know that's when you get your shout outs. I give you your shout outs. On Wednesday. So I'm coming back to wind down Wednesday. Fam, fam I might be exhausted though. But I'm going to try to get up and come to wind down Wednesday. I promise you. We're going to talk about everything. We're going to talk about how good God is. We're going to laugh. We're just, just going to just enjoy our Wednesday. It's good. Wind Down Winds is coming back. Full force. So get whatever you're going to drink. I might, hey, little fam. I might bring me some little bills to the party tonight. Some little fancy bills. I might bring me some. The little lady bills. I might bring me some. Well, yeah. 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 I peeled it for you. At least you can't do is eat it yourself. Hey, well, put it right there till you're ready for it. I'm going to put it right there till you're ready for it, fam. All right. Fam, we got to help one another. It's set. Hold on. Hold on, fam. It's sad that when people help each other, they think somebody owed them something because they helped you. Like I said, God said he like a cheerful giver. He like for people to help each other, be cheerful at helping somebody. Be happy and blessed because he got a he got a blessing for you with your name on it just for helping that person. Yeah. So from now on, fam, I want you to think of it this way: when you help someone, think of it as if I'm doing something. I'm doing some work for the Lord. Yeah, because you got to do work for the Lord. Oh, yeah. I want you to take this, <laughs> this red pepper. <laughs> I want you to take the red pepper, and I want you to take this, and I want you to bite this, stick it in the sauce, and bite this. It's going to ruin your whole... Man, I'm telling you, this little thing is so hot. <laughs> oh, my God. I bit it like a social film thinking it was a bell pepper. My mouth was just not coming down. Well, anyway, fam, look. 
Don't be selfish. You know, I was, I was, another thing is, I was laughing at work yesterday because this girl at work, she said, let me, Miss Cat, let me hold $5. I said, I ain't got it. So we all started laughing. She said, no, Miss Cat, let me hold $5. I said, I ain't got it. I said, ain't that what people be telling each other? When you ask somebody for something, I ain't got it. Knowing they got it, but being selfish, don't want to help somebody, but if she would have really needed that $5 film, I would have gave her that $5. I had no problem with it. But it was just a joke over there. I was like, I ain't got it. I ain't got it. <laughs> you know how people always out of name. Got it. Stop speaking them into your life. Even if you don't have it, just say, I don't have it right now, but I will have it. Just give me a moment. Tell me how they ain't got it. I ain't got to stop speaking it into your mouth. I told you, your tongue is a powerful thing. You need to stop speaking it into existence, into your life. You don't have it temporarily. You don't have it momentarily. That's how you got to say things, fam. When you don't have something, then somebody say, well, don't be honest. I ain't got nothing right. I just don't have it momentarily. I don't have it right now, but I'll have it in a minute. Just give me a minute. Okay? I, to I keep telling you this. I don't know why this has been on my heart, too. Stop speaking things into your life that's not worth speaking it into. Okay? I, I told y'all I use my hands a lot. I want you to start speaking things into existence into your life. Okay? We're going to have to start speaking positive things into our lives. That's what we mess up at. We always speak negative things. Stop speaking negative things into your life, fam. Like yesterday, I got up for work. I said, I will be happy. I will laugh. Y'all, I laugh so hard at work. I'm telling you, they was like, girl, you is so tickled. I spoke that into my life. And when I tell y'all I was almost on the floor, my stomach was hurting about this. I was laughing at this person at work yesterday morning. They couldn't understand how hard I was laughing and why hard it was funny for me. Because I had asked God, let my day be full of happiness. Let me laugh. Let me, that's what I asked him for. And that's what started happening. Y'all, I started laughing all day long. I'm telling you, speaking it into your life now. God likes a cheerful giver. Stop being selfish and help one another. Yes, I would help. I would help. I don't know about you, but I would. And I would help do that out the kindness of my heart. Not looking for something back for somebody. Oh, they got to give. They got to do something. Oh, they ain't do that for me. Oh, I helped that girl the other day. No, I wouldn't do that. Back in the day, I was like that. That was me back then. Oh, I gave her my money. She can't even help me. I asked her to borrow something. She can't even pay my money back. Such, such, such. That's not me anymore. What can I do to help? If I can do anything to help, let me know. This is me now. And when I do it, I do it out the kindness of my heart, not looking for anything back. That's what God wants us to do. How would you feel if you got stuck in a rut and you call somebody on the phone, that same person that you helped, and they said, I don't have it. But you get angry because you thought, I helped them last week. I helped her. And she said, what would you do? Well, me, I would say, well, thank you. I appreciate it. But God will find a way for me. I spoke that into existence because he found the way for me. You feel me? I didn't get mad when I was talking about what I did for you or how I did. That was me back then because I would have did it too for you. I ain't going to even lie to you. I would have did it too. But I got a different perspective on life now. When you find a different perspective about life and you following God and not man, you look at things differently. Yeah. I, I told you I was waiting on you to come and get it. This for you. You like blue crabs. Well, get yours, because I'm going to put this up, because it's got to be put up. Okay, 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 okay. All right, I'll let you come get it when you get ready, all right? Well, ma'am, guess what? My cousin was in the building, but she's about to exit the building. Yep, tonight I'm going to give away two sauces. I'll be on Wine Down Wednesday about 8, 8.30. 9 o'clock at the most. I'm only going to stay on an hour at the most. You know, I got a new shift, so I can't be up all times of the night. So, fam, have a blessed day. Know that God loves you, and I love you too. Be a cheerful giver. Help someone today. I don't care if you just helping them. Talk they stuff. 
I don't care if you just buy them a piece of gum, bubble gum. I don't care. Just help somebody today. Let God know that you heard what he said. Be a cheerful giver, okay? Be blessed, man.